Hey, today we are going to show you a new product that I'm pretty excited about. My name is Dwayne Skelton with Skelton's Equipment and Kubota developed this product uh, probably six months ago. I first saw it in their, their new flyer. It's a K-Line that's called their K-Connect. It's kind of exciting because it gives you something to do with your RTV that you wouldn't normally think about doing. And when I first saw it, the fact that it's PTO driven makes it pretty cool. It's a, it's a quick hookup. So you put this power unit underneath your RTV and you can just snap into either one of these attachments. We've got a broom and a snowblower. If I can install it, I think pretty much anybody can. Let's go see if we can do this. Now the broom is kind of easy because it rolls. Got to move forward a little bit. I'll probably just push the broom back to it. So as you can tell, the broom's got casters on it, so it makes this a little easier. See the two yellow tabs there? That's all I did was lined up the two yellow tabs. The cool part is this has got kind of a remote. You can take it out with you in case you don't trust yourself. We're operating this button. Just pull it into place, picks it up. And now the easy part, you just hook up the remote so you can, right here, orange to orange, makes it fairly easy. Snap them in. And this is for your hydraulic swing. Now all you do here is this pin. All you do is go like that. And now it's locked on. And this is all you do to hook up the PTO. And it's a quick connect and we're off. We're off to the races. If you're like me, you like to keep the rocks off of your driveway. So I'll give you a little demonstration. So you put it low and you turn the PTO on here. Starts it up. Now the cool part here is you can actually click and you're scraping, you set the PTO throttle, and that's all there's to it. And it makes pretty short work of a job like this. This is probably one of my favorite jobs right now. See some rocks there, I just push them off to that side. So the cool part about this handle is you just touch two buttons and you get it into float. Now you know it's in float, that blue light comes on. Now you're in float and you're ready to go. Bye. So it's very easy to use. It's very effective. And uh, it's, it's kind of a fun job. I actually prefer to do this when it's raining because then I'm inside, got a nice cab. Kubota's probably got the nicest cab on an RTV on the market. And you got tunes. There you go. If you like news, that's me. There we go. You got heat, air conditioning. It's nice and warm in here. You got windshield wipers. We got all kinds of lights and safety things. So, so now you just touch this and it shuts it off. The cool part is mechanically driven. Most of our competitors are hydraulically driven. This is actually too much fun, so you just got to do this way. You got it on here. I usually do this at night when nobody's around here, so everybody doesn't know, doesn't know I'm having so much fun. I'm going to show you how easy it is to take this on and off. So we got to unlock it. Just spring-loaded pin on each side. Take the PTL. That's all there's to on that. Take the hoses off. Just put this back on float. Comes down. Put a little further down. It's actually already off. Just roll this away. And there you go. Now we'll go mount up the snowblower. Snowblower is a little trickier because it isn't on a roller and if you had two people you could probably make this a lot easier but I probably have to get out a couple times get myself readjusted here. Hey we're cooking. Just got to go ahead a little bit. So that's 
pretty slick. Lock the pins. PTO's engaged. We got hydraulics to run the spout. So now we'll take it back off. And there you go. That didn't take all that long. And you can switch back and forth in a matter of minutes. Now we can use this thing for our lot runner rounder. And uh, the secret to this whole thing is this PTO drive. I don't know of another company that does that. And the fact that it's easy to hook up. Um, it's only available on this model right here, the 1100C. We put extra lights, road light kit on it. So I enjoy this most in the dark. That's when I get time to do this kind of stuff. It's usually after everybody's gone home. Thank you for watching Skolton's Equipment.